Hi, uh, welcome to a quick walk around video from Mercedes A Class. Um, unfortunately, Travis Perkins over here insists on doing a load of drilling today, so I apologise if you can't hear me all that well on this one, but I'll try and speak up. Uh, right, a couple of little uh, cosmetic issues that I'm going to sort out on this, but I will point them out to you as we go round. Uh, the main one being the wheels. As you can see, these are like a two tone wheel, and the surface is quite worn on all of them. So they are going to be done, so see past that if you can, please. Bodywork in general is pretty good throughout. Michelin tyres on the rear, budget tyres on the back. Again, you can see that wheel is going to benefit from a refurb. The other issue, which is harder to make out in a video, this bumper corner has been painted before. Uh, it's noticeably duller and you can see the line where they've really badly tried to lose it there. Um, so what I'm going to do is repaint that whole rear bumper. Again that wheel probably the best of the bunch but if we're refurbing them we may as well do all four. And that is probably the worst of them. There you are, you've seen all that now. Other than those two bits I pointed out, the bodywork is nice and clean. It has the xenon lights there, I'll zoom in on that so you can read it. And that's daytime running lights as well. We're going to have a look inside now. So it's the sport model, so you've obviously got the big chunky sport seats in the front there. We'll have a look in the back first though, so there we are. Electric windows. It's a half leather trim. There is a centre seat belt with a small armrest, so it's three across the back. The outer two have Isofix points there and there, and a decent bit of legroom in the A-Class as well. Get inside now where it should be a bit quieter. Okay, uh, so you've got electric mirrors there. And electric windows front and rear. Automatic lights. And your electronic parking brake is just below that. It's the newer style digital dash in the centre there. As you can see the mileage is displayed 72,517. Uh, Multi-function sport steering wheel. So your onboard computer functions are there. And then you, if you link your phone up via Bluetooth, which this has got, that's the controls there. And there's a voice command switch. I'm unsure if this has got voice command or not. I'll press it and see if we can find out. Yes. Okay, so you can control the nav and bits and bobs like that via the voice command. Now the screen is fine, just on the camera and the video, it can look like it flickers because it has a different refresh rate to the camera. So, but in person, this is all fine. So, radio, auxiliary, there's your nav. I'll come back out of there so you can see the map. Is it touchscreen? I don't know. No, it's not touchscreen. I'm controlling it via this little dial down here. So, can't know why it's been set. heating controls there. I've got the aircon and it's blowing lovely and cold so not in need of a regas or anything like that. You've got a 12 volt point there where the cigarette lighter would ordinarily have been. A uh, six speed manual gearbox. Like I say that's the control for your sat nav. Cup holders there. Sliding armrest here with storage inside. And then down in there, if you can make it out, is the USB port for your auxiliary audio. Okay, 
got the locking wheel nut bolts and a Mercedes Benz wallet in there. We've got passenger airbags over here, along with additional airbags here. And I think there might be some over here as well. Uh, no, I can't see any there. So I guess there's one there. Uh, right, I think I've covered everything in here. Um, if I've missed anything, please just pop in and um, either see us or you can give me a call and I'll, I'll come out and check and tell you over the phone if there's a certain feature that it has or hasn't got. I'll include close-up photos of the interior, the exterior and the service history as well. But if I've missed anything there, obviously give us a shout as well. Okay, thank you very much for watching.